Hello everybody, it's Nim and welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing another zoo tour and today we are touring the Sabari Zoo made by Xing Wailu 1982. It is his first zoo. It took them three months to make it and they hope we enjoy and like it. You know what? Um, I did enjoy and like it. It's a very wild zoo. Um, it said Safari Zoo. It wasn't much of a safari but we'll get into, into the video but do stay tuned because it looks quite amazing. And guys, as always, if you enjoy the video after the after you watch the video, please make sure you leave a like, a comment, and possibly subscribe to the channel. It helps grow the channel. And that's, you know, what we want. We want to build a community. So I'm going to leave you with some cinematics. And after that, we are going to go right into the actual zoo tour. See you in a bit. this is the zoo how it looks right now it is let's see it is quite big i mean like the end of the map is there but you can see how much is built in here and i love all these glass buildings already you guys know i love glass buildings so well, we're gonna go into the entrance so you can see it here let's see Oops. and then we are going to go right into our zoo tour so we have an entrance or like a spawn point and then we come to the entrance of the zoo i love this with the foliage by the way this looks really nice. Really, really nice. It's a safari zoo with a little rainbow here. Tickets, information. Behind there are some toilets. Lovely worked in. Really like that. It says so above it. Ooh. Nice. Where you can find all the animals. I love it. Like, obviously, like it's an uh, African based zoo. So naturally, we're going to have a lot of um, African animals. I really like this. Let's uh, go in with our guest. I can see we have some protesters there, but we're not going to get too busy about that. Oh, I love this fountain. Will you look at that? Oh, this is lovely. Let me just screenshot this, man. This is absolutely lovely. So um, we're going to go clockwise so i can see some glass buildings there but we are going to go this way oh which is staff only but we're gonna have a sneak peek in anyway let's look around oh you have the back of the toilets nice so in here we have some staff facilities we oh, really like this this looks really nice this is really well made with the steam here as well really really enjoy this Okay, so let's go to the big oh, gift shop. The cosmic, oh wait, it's a food shop. Cosmic cow, ooh, with all the drinks and foods. It's really nice, some wild grass. <laughs> nice. I like this as well, what's this here? It's a pip shop water, nice, 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 nice. So you can see the PFL habitat there, but I wanna have a look at this. What is this? 943 items what the heck oh i have panels these are all the different oh my gosh whoa okay that must have taken you so long and it looks absolutely amazing with all the animals here i love that so um i'm kind of interested in the peafowl habitat i mean look at this we have a Maxilenti, ooh, what a sign. Oh, it's a hard. That's so wise, nice. This giant pizza here, built out of rocks. Oh, wow. I'm getting some inspiration here. Oh, Africa area, American bison. Let's go to the American bison first. These are flamingos. Can we go in here? Yes, we can, nice. Oh, this is very realistic. I like this. Ooh. I like this so the cons fly away. This is really nice. Reminds a little bit of a circus stand, and that's not meant to be mean. I just, I like that. Let's have a quick look in here. With all the ropes here along the sides, the water. This is really large. 
Obviously the flamingos. And you have a sleeping area for them, staff entrance. Ah, oh, you can see them from that side as well. Oh, they have baby. Two babies, nice. This looks really nice. You also didn't put a lot of uh, flamingos in here, because that's what I tend to do. I like just to stuff it full with flamingos. This is the exact right amount of, of animals in here. I love it. You have street fox. Oh, the smoke coming out. I love your attention to detail. Like, didn't you say it was your first zoo? I think I read that. I'm, I'm forgetting it. Oh, we have this lovely habitat for the bison with a reed here and then a little home. I'm guessing this is intentional that you're missing some items here. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing. Same on the sides. Maybe it's not intentional. Maybe it just didn't load well. I don't know. Oh, I like this. It looks really nice. Look at this as well. So much detail in here, man. And here you have some mud pools or mud baths, I believe they're called. Oh, you even did this thing with some leaves. That's so cool. Like, again, almost 200 items. That's really amazing. Really, really cool. So we have the American bison, but what's on the other side? Is that a pronghorn I see? Oh, antelope. I was close. <laughs> Ooh, I like that. I like the roof here. Nice. Feels quite modern and yet also rustic. Again with the, oh, the waterfall and here are these logs. You have used this so well. This is just wow. Ah, oh, they have babies. This is really cool. Again with the details here. Lovely. Let's go back. Well, like back to this area. Stuff pathing. Ooh, this looks interesting. What's in there? Oh, stuff only. Ooh, it's the main office. I mean, this looks like an office. Wow. Just wow. Ooh, there's a waterfall behind there. That's just. Oof. That's really clever. Toilet facilities. Looks really nice. Oh, a mirror and a washer. Nice. What what you do makes a di oh, what you do makes a difference. And you have to decide what kind of difference you want to make. Jane Goodall. Nice. Okay. I'm guessing. Um that's just pure, purely what I'm thinking. Like you're not the one that made this. I think, because I see this font a lot of times and I don't think uh, you're the original creator, I'm not sure. If you are, well done. If you're not, um, you know, it's okay to use stuff from other people. But I would mention it in your description if I were you. Okay, Amazon Adventures. I'm guessing an art farm or something? Oh no, exhibits. Oh, it's not turned on. Ah, these are. This looks really nice. Oh, 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 Komodo. Nice. I love the way this looks with the beams as well. Really, really nice. I think I clicked something. No, okay, it did. Good. Okay. okay, let's. Uh, I don't want to get lost. I love this way as well. Like these are doors, and obviously the guests don't open them. But you know, in real life, you would. Salt water crocodiles. Let's observe. Oh, you have the water level. Nice. Oh, there's a baby. Wait, are these gharials? Oh no, it's boxed in. Yeah, they're... Oh. That's weird. Is it good now? Yeah, it is. They're gharials. They're not saltwater crocodiles. Does it didn't say souls water crocodiles? Yeah. Oh well. They're gharials, by the way. <gasps> McDonald's. Did you know? Oh, and I can't read that. That's a shame. 
So up here, I'm guessing you have another viewing point. Yeah, we go to a different section. So we're gonna go finish this first. Oh, I like this. McDonald's, yes. Can we just... This is so cute. Why didn't I think of this? Just why? And we have McDonald's. I'm loving it. Uh, that's so nice. The water features here and the wheel. Oh. And here we are having a staff area, I believe. Ooh, there is a now monitor here though. Hidden away. This looks really nice. I enjoy this. And there's the Nile monitor being cute and all. And you also have a top floor where you can view. Nice. Oh, you have all the elephants across in between. Didn't even notice that. That's a really nice detail. Ooh, ooh, the top. Look at the top. Cool. Ah, and the air conditioning. Nice. Okay, let's just... We were here. Ah, the ATM. Special box. Gorilla information. Nice. I'm guessing these will be the gorillas. Oh, wow. Will you look at this? Okay, I don't know or I don't know or I don't remember how long it took you, but wow. Oh no, they're boxed. Unbox all animals. And like that's sad, we don't want them boxed. Ah. This is really cool. Really tall glass, which you know is necessary. This is really amazing. Can they walk out of here? I'm guessing they can. And they jump out of there, even better. I can hear all the alerts in the background. <laughs> Your zoo has a lot of alerts. Oh, I like this. And I like that you put a uh, one-way glass in there. This is quite large. I like it. There's some open space here. Oh, Nice. Alright, let's just... Wow. This is really modern. Really, really nice. So we have the gorillas on that side. Now on this side we have tortoises. You have a lot. Wow. I like I like, I like. And then that's to the orangutans. But this is stuff. And then you have some toilets. And then here you go down to another area. Oh, you also look by the way in here. This is really nice. I love this piece of art. 305 objects. What the heck? So here we have a little restaurant or cafe. Let's just go in. Ah. Nice. So your staff areas as well. It looks really nice. It's not uh, stuffed away in the corner staff area. Which I quite enjoy. And then on this side, I believe you had a coffee shop. Yes. And that's a normal coffee shop, not a Dutch coffee shop. I hope. <laughs> so let's go back. This is just, you know, food and drinks, which I really enjoy that you've put so much of that in there. That's something I always forget. So let's see. Here we had the um, tortoises. Oh, you put two pieces spe species together. And here, I'm guessing you have orangutans, yes. But where are they? Are they boxed somewhere? This is quite a nice habitat you have here for them. Oh, there's one. Found you. But where are the others? They should be here somewhere. Oh, they're escaping! Oh no! Look, he escaped. Well, tough luck. <laughs> and they can go up here. Ah, oh, there's a baby one. That's really cool. He's gonna climb down. 
Nice. I really love the way that you incorporated this in the rocks. Kind of reminds me of a game I used to play in Guild Wars 2. You had fractals, which were kind of like missions. And you had this uh, mission that was like built into the rocks and you had to climb up and then defeat bosses. Really reminds me of this. Oh, and then you have this lovely view of the entire zoo. Let me just screenshot this as well. This looks really nice. And then you have the Rainforest Cafe. I love what you did with all the names here. I like the interior. It looks really, really nice. Let's see. Let's go to the tiger. Or oh, yeah, we've seen that. Tiger view. Exotic animal transport. Nothing in there. Where's my tiger view? Is this is stuff. I love the way that you did with the change. There is no tiger there. Or wait, is it? Oh wait, it's up. Never mind. I think it's up at least. Let's go up. Ooh. Oh, God. we almost completely skipped the tiger, which would be a shame because the tigers are amazing. This is quite a way up, man. I swear, if there isn't a tiger here, I'm gonna scream. Oh! You can look in their entire habitat. Okay, so, is there a way to get even higher? There is. Okay, so this is the top level open space. Ah! Oh, there they are. I found them. The four. One, two, three, five. Five. Oh, and they're eating. This is really nice. Putting like the uh, food where they can, see, where the guests can see it. Also, Look. I hear you. You're making noise. Quite nice. You know, would have loved some bamboo in there because you know I always associate tigers with bamboo. But this looks really cool with the steam here and the waterfalls. Really nice. Okay, I'm just gonna. No, cheat the system and go down this way. <laughs> it's pink. ATMs. So this looks like the zoo management office. I was just about to say that. I'm trying to gulpy. That's really cool. Lemur home. I love lemurs. Ah. Uh, Oh, they're cute. I like it. I like the habitat as well. I would like to see some outside space for them as well. But I like this. It's really nice. You see security cameras to make us feel safe. Really nice. All of this sign just standing there. Dark green, bright blue, dark grey. Uh, I want dark grey water, please. Ooh. Oh yeah, I almost forget this was a safari zoo. We haven't even touched on the safari thing. Lemur's rest view. Ah, uh, it's the sleeping area. And he, you almost scared me. Oh, what the heck's wrong with you? You're spinning out of control and you've escaped. Well, I'm not gonna solve that. <laughs> not today at least. Oh, so here we have the red lemur. Zoos often uh, like put them separate. I always put them in the same zoo, but when I go to real life, they're often separated. Oh, I like this. I wish the other lemurs had a home like this. This looks really nice with this bridge. Really, really nice. You can walk through it. Nice. Zoom up. Okay, we're here. We want to go there, I guess. I'm not sure. Ooh. This is made out of wood. Nice. Love this bit in the middle. Get some really nice shades. Ooh, wow. Let me just uh, screenshot this. This looks really cool. 
Bears. So it is a safari zoo, just bears. <laughs> I love this. I love all of it being random. <laughs> Pro tip though, um, you never want to close off a path like this. Because when all these people are standing here, it's not really something um, you do. Paths always need to be connected. There needs to be a way around. Oh, baby. Ooh. I love all the climbing. They can go anywhere. So we found a baby. And they have a cave here, I guess. So if we go through here, do they have a cave? Ah. So many foliage. Oh, we're behind the waterfall. Ah, it is a cave. That's mommy, and then you can go here. Mm -hmm. ah, this is really cool. And then they have another sleeping area here. Nice. Really, really nice. Let's go uh, back. Because through here, this is water, which is really nice done. And then you have a red panda. And red pandas are so cute. Look, it's asleep. We used to have the Rangers Club uh, for the World Nature Foundation, WWF, no, WNF. And it, its mascot is a, is a red panda called Vibi. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I did this as well with the round holes they can go through. Nice, nice, nice. So in here we have enter only. I'm going to exit through this as well. <laughs> Mandrels. Which I always confuse with baboons. Because they kind of look like baboons to me. But oh well. Ooh, I like this. This looks really nice. Same as a waterfall. Cool. And you have this lovely glass roof. I imagine it's going to be really hot in here in summer. And I'm a, I'm a fan of giving people um, or animals a, an outside space as well. Exit owner. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be rebellious. I'm gonna exit through the enter. Ha ha ha. No one tells me what to do. The grizzly bear? Nice. Now what do we have here? Is this the... No, this is the Japanese macaque. Well, I love this donut. Let's just go in here. Nice. I love this structure. It looks so amazing. Do they actually climb on that? And I'm not sure. At least I'm guessing they do, but I didn't see it. This looks really cool. But again, it's close. I'm not gonna complain about that too much, like I've said it. I'm not gonna say it again. I'll try at least. American mangrove. Oh yeah, the mangroves. Aren't there mangroves in Madagascar as well? Wait, I said America, I meant African. The stuff, this food. We've had the Japanese macaque, so let's go up here. Feeling like giving by the rocks, we are going to go into a little bit of a safari. Am I right? Yes, I am right, because there are hyenas. Which always reminds me of Lion King. I can hear them. Where are there they are? Oops. There you go. Oh, they have this entire walkthrough habitat. It's nice. This meat looks gross. <laughs> so you go here, like this. African wild dogs. Guessing that's to the hyenas. Let's go to the African wild dogs. So many stairs. Okay, let's let's go here. Ooh. Okay, just so you know, I have completely lost orientation. I have literally no clue to where I am. 
Which could be fine, you know. Ah, look there, the wall dogs. I think that this is the border of the zoo, right? Yeah. I love this building. It looks so nice. Alicia, ooh, conversation. Save the animals. I like this. This looks really nice. And with the lights, oh, I can't wait to show this zoo in the uh, in nighttime. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's go down. So that's staff again. I do love your staff areas. I mean, it looks so happy. Same as in there. It looks really, really happy. I can hear something. What's in here? Ostriches. Ooh, look at this fence. Looks like a petting zoo fence. I like it. Yeah, you can't feed them. Twilight Park. I'm going all over. Oh. Ooh. Wow. Oh wait, I know where we are. We're on that side of the map because there was a big, big building. Love all the snowy rocks. So there should be reindeers in here. Ah, oh, there's one. I like what you did with all the snowy rocks and the ice rocks. Really like that. Looks like Christmas. So, and then we're back in the, you know, other biome where it's quite warm. You even have polar bears. Are you kidding me? You have actual, you have entire winter village. All right, I'm a little bit confused about the theming of your zoo, but any other point, I don't really care. What are you looking at? <laughs> Ooh, it is cold in here. Ah, so that was the other big place. Wow, I mean, this is big. Oh, there they are. Or one is. Ah, oh, there's number two. I like this. This is terrain, isn't it? Yeah, that's terrain. Nice. Save our world. Save polar bear hashtag. <laughs> I like that. Down point, we have to go all the way here to go out again. It's a little bit annoying. Ah, oh, the Christmas tree. There's little pine cones in there. I think you built that section after the Arctic pack came out. <laughs> Gift shop. I was going to look in there. Ooh. Kitty land. Yeah, with all these lovely flowers. Ah, Artvark. Nice. Really, really nice. Then you have the tape here. Oh, I don't even know where to go. Let's go to the wolf. And the Artvark again. Everyone's going there. I want to go in here. It's a polar wolf. It's minus nine degrees. That is cold. Ooh. Oh, I was hoping it was going to attack the meat. It didn't. I have a baby. I'm going to call it Ghost. This looks really nice. Again, like, I think you built this after the Arctic pack came out. Which I get, I do that in my zoos as well. Lovely foliage, like really dense. Some parrots. Which of course we still don't have aviaries. Here we have the um, wild swine. <gasps> they have babies as well. I like this. Really clever. 
Fivarium? I don't know what a Fivarium is. I know a Terrarium, but a Fivarium? Oh. Looks very subtropical. So then we have something. We have a protester for something. Ooh, oh, I like that with glass bits in there. I'm not sure where we're going now. We'll see. Ooh, more exhibits. Exhibits are always my least favorite part of Planet Zoo. Just because you can't custom made it. That's that's really annoying. And here we have Ah the Pangolin. I love with the little vines. You so they can see you but you can't really see them, so they have privacy. It's really nice. Okay, I believe we still have the pea fowls to go. And the tapers, but I don't know where they are. I can hear them being boxed up somewhere. Okay, I'm just gonna move you here as well. I always find this really sad, you know, sometimes they just get boxed up and you don't know why. But hey. So here we have the tape here. And then we had the pee file home where, oh my gosh, it's so crowded. What the heck is this? Oh. Ooh. This looks really, really nice. Look at this dome, wow. That's really cool. And I believe that is the conclusion of our zoo, because here's the middle part again. Let's see if we didn't miss anything. We've been there, we've been there. Have we been here? I don't believe we've seen this. How did we get there? African Adventure, okay. Well. Ah, it's a 4x4 four four ride. Okay, I'm not going to do the 4x4 four four ride. Just because, ugh, 4x4 four four rides always, you know, get stuck. I'm going to, ooh. I'm just going to, like, scooch over the rails like this. Lovely waterfall. Wait, it's a monorail. Oh. Did not expect that. Still not going to ride it, though. <laughs> oh, wow. Buffles, giraffes, zebras. This looks nice. It's this big home where they sleep. Here, another one with lovely glass. Love the rocks. Yeah. So, I believe that was the entire zoo. Question mark. I think I did everything. Yeah, we've seen it all. Well, that was the zoo, guys. If you enjoyed. Oh, wait. We're gonna. Look at it in nighttime. Let's see. Oh, oh, wait, there it goes. Yeah, this is lit up like I expected. I did, you know, expected some more lights, but lights is always the last thing I do, so I always forget that as well. So can't really blame anything for that. Anyways, guys, if you like this video, make sure to leave a thumbs up and give it a comment. You can also subscribe to the channel to get more zoo tours. We do them every week and we also build a zoo. We do that on Friday, so make sure you stay tuned for that. And I hope to see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.